Hi guys, so it's very early in the morning and I'm prepping for a setup. So I just want to share what I'm doing with you. Guys, these balloons are amazing, they're so good. They are perfect, the colors are wonderful. Guys, this is called Cameo, I think if I'm pronouncing it right. This color is called Cameo and it is just the best color that I've ever used. And it was a struggle finding it for my client, but I'm so happy that I did. I found it for him, and this is going to be for a gender reveal. And I'm using Top Sex Cameo, I'm using Harrison, okay, and all the colors are really, really rich in a way that I don't need to double stop, even though he requested that we double stop the balloons. Um, I just double stuffed one of them. Let me show you. So, guys, I double stuffed one of the balloons because my client requested that the balloon should be double stuffed. But for this uh, top text balloons, I do not need to double stuff them. Look at this. I double stuffed one of these. You can see here it's thicker. Okay. We have to be this one. Okay, you see. I tied from the inside, meaning this one is double stuffed. The only difference is that it is hard. Okay, it is harder than this one. That's all the difference. But look at it in color, no difference. So it is going to be a waste of time to, to double stuff them because top text balloons are the best. I was not paid to do this video, okay? So, but I just wanted to let you know how beautiful these balloons are. So I'm going to be. I'll continue prepping for my decoration for this morning and i'm sorry for my voice guys i just woke up on there um i'm going to be doing a gender review so these are the colors we are using i will have this other white i've forgotten the name of the white it's not a regular white okay so uh, i would like you to set up with me so i wanted to you know first of all introduce you to the balloons that i'm using and then we can go from here okay so as usual i'm just inflating my balloon different sizes as usual small balloons big balloons large balloons so my balloons are in different sizes i have 11 inch balloons 12 inch balloons 10 inch balloons 5 inch balloons and 18 inch balloons okay so that's what we're going to be using so let me just start by showing you i put it in my nozzles and then I will inflate. After I inflate my balloons, I'll press them down by releasing the air to shape it and make it round and beautiful. So you can see this one is bigger than this one, but I'm still going to shape them by pressing it down and releasing the air so that my balloons can be nicely shaped and very round. Just like this, just like this, and then I'm going to tie. When I'm tying, I tie very closely to the balloons because I know my necks. I just discovered one way to do my gallons by using the necks to, you know, put my balloons together to create my gallons, and it is awesome, easy, and it makes it beautiful. So I'm just going to tie like this. And that is it. I have very good necks to work with, guys. This top text balloons are the best. Okay, if you want some balloons? Go for top top text. It is a little more expensive than Carlson, but they are good. Okay. Again. Press down and release the air. Press down and release the air. Making sure one is bigger than the other, and then I tie. So, guys, I'll just keep doing this until I'm done inflating all my balloons, and then we are going to, you know, put them into clusters. After we put them into clusters, I'm going to back them or carry them along with me in my car, and we are going to get to the client's house and set up. Okay, so that's what we'll be doing this morning. Uh, let me go ahead and inflate this balloon so that I don't make your life boring by watching me inflate balloons. Ok 
okay so i stopped again for a minute to show you my second vortex balloons that i'm inflating lord have mercy <laughs> i'm going to link the right the right color in the description below okay guys so that you see the right color i'm talking about look this thing is a little bit glossy it looks like a cream white and it's a little bit glossy it's so beautiful and guys look at that it is soft and at the same time it is you no know, very rich and durable look at that. see that oh my goodness this is so beautiful look oh my god it goes so well with this color i don't know how a man is going to pick such beautiful colors he was like this is what i want this is the white i want he didn't know the names but he kept showing me you know i had to do my research <laughs> Because I'm here to, you know, satisfy my clients. So I don't joke. I don't joke when it comes to balloons for my client. I get the best, okay? So yeah, just wanted to show you this balloon. You see that? I lose the glossy that looks so beautiful. Yeah, guys, I just wanted to show you again. Toftex did not pay me to do this video. It's not sponsored by Toftex, but when something is good, let us share, okay? Sharing with you so that you know what to get. Let's continue inflating. <laughs> let me continue inflating my balloons, guys. I just wanted to show you my very new friend that I found. So one thing I noticed with the white is the necks are not as stretchy as the pink, okay? So just look. These necks are not as stretchy as the pink. They're a little bit they're harder, okay? For the white, the, the, the necks are harder. The skin is harder than the pink. Let me show you. You see how stretchy the, the pink is? Not, not pink, sorry guys, the cameo, okay? It's stretchy and the, the white is not as stretchy, okay? So I just wanted to show you that difference. I know I should be working fast and preparing to go, but I'm just showing you the good things that I'm using. Okay, guys, so we are done inflating the balloons. No, I'm going to stop here. I'm not done yet. I'll take the rest to my client's house and I'll inflate them there um, because I don't want it to be too much for my car to carry since I'll be carrying other things along with me. Um, I'll just leave it like this, but I want to show you how I put them in clusters. So what I do is take two pairs and I'm going to twist them together. Very nicely and very well so that they don't come out while you are working. I'll put it that way. Um, since they're not up to eight uh, balloons, so I'll just put them into little clusters and yeah, I'll build them in little clusters and then I'll carry them with me. My car is loaded and I'm getting ready to go and I just wanted to show you what it looks like I have my balloons right there because it is my car if I put them in bags they're not going to fit so the black bag that you see just right behind me those are my five inch balloons that I inflated so I just have them in the black bag and when I get to the venue I'm going to inflate more balloons and yeah it's kind of cold so let's go guys all right so now we are at the client's house and i'm starting off by using the balloons that are earlier inflated at home to build my gallons so i'll start with these ones and then i will inflate more balloons as i go 
like I earlier said, I discovered this method to build my gallons, which is um, very helpful and it makes the job very easy for me. And, and it is me pulling the necks of my balloons and tying them together to create my garland. As you can see me, I'm just pulling the necks of my balloons and tying them together. So when I get a balloon that the necks are not very soft to work with or that are not stretchy, what I do is I just cut my 260 balloons and I attach it to my clusters and then I tie them together. That also works very well. So the bottom line is that I'm not using a string or a fishing line or a ribbon like I usually do. This one is very nice and it, it makes the job look professional. So like you can see my balloons are going to be in color blockings. Like you see me having blue together, white together and cameo together. That is because they are going to be in color blocking. So once I've cleaned my board, I just start building my garland, which is first of all creating the what I call the skeleton. I will start by creating my skeleton and once that is done, I'm going to inflate more balloons and fill them up to build my garland. And again, what I'm using to attach my balloons onto the board is a transparent command hook. I'm going to link that in the description box below. Be sure to check it out guys so yeah now that i have my skeleton i'm going to build the other side of my garland and and then i will start adding more balloons to make it fuller and beautiful all right guys we are almost done here we are going to go in with our five inch balloons and add them to our garland it makes the thing look so beautiful it's a game changer to a balloon garland again I'm using my 260 balloons to attach my 5 inch clusters to my garland all right so right at this time I'm checking with my client to make sure that she's satisfied to make sure that it's exactly what she's looking for and then I'm going to go on to add my flower and the vinyl. Yeah, I constructed the flower by myself. So guys, let me know in the comment section if you would like to know how I did my flower. Again, we are going to add in our theme to the board. And once we are done, that will be it for the garland the big review i really love this theme it made it so beautiful and i really enjoyed um working with my clients and i enjoyed creating this garland i don't know what you think guys this is gorgeous this is beautiful and one thing that stands out for me is to be able to satisfy my clients and of course i'm going to add a comment from my clients at the end of this video make sure you watch till the end all right guys so that will be it for today's video thank you so much for, thank you for your support be sure to check the description box for items that i used again i'm using affiliate links so if you buy anything using my link i'm going to get a little commission so thank you again for watching and make sure that you like comment in the comment section so that i'll know that you stop by and if you love my content be sure to subscribe for more videos and if you have any question leave a comment and i'll be sure to answer you to the best of my ability again thank you for watching and happy decorating bye